Um, by statute, a grand jury every year needs to inspect the correctional facilities that you have in your county. Uh, we're here today with uh, our district attorney, uh, Beth Heckert. So thank you so much for joining us. Oh, thanks for having me over here. The grand jury does something called an annual special corrections grand jury report. Did I get that right? Yeah. So tell us about that because that's really kind of a unique uh, um, role that they play as well. It's set by statute. So okay. um, by statute, a grand jury every year needs to inspect the correctional facilities that you have in your county. So Jackson County, um, we consider that we have uh, three basically. So we have the adult jail, we have the transition center, and we have the juvenile um, detention area. And so we convene a special grand jury just for this purpose um, once a year, ask the court to get us seven more people, and we convene an extra day's grand jury. Um, and we assign an attorney to it, and that attorney goes with them and uh, also brings in witnesses for them. So depending on what they are interested in, uh, they get to ask. We typically have the sheriff, um, the jail captain, someone who, who provides services in detention. So we kind of have a list of people that previous grand jurors have asked for, and okay. we offer those to them. They also actually talk to inmates. So we randomly um, pick a couple of inmates. They have to be people who aren't pending their charge. They have to be after their charge, and they come in, and it's surprising sometimes what kind of questions the grand jurors might ask them. You know, how's the food? Um, okay. How's the uh, conditions? Um, and then they actually walk through the facilities and look for things. So it's a chance really for seven members of the public to get inside of a facility and talk to all of the people who work within that facility or who have to reside in that facility and find out if there are problems. And at the end of the report, the grand jurors actually make recommendations. So those recommendations can be used by um, county commissioners. We share that report with all of the department heads um, from the different facilities, as well as the county commissioners, the sheriff. Um, but it's a public report. It's available on our website. You can see the reports back a few years. So uh, it kind of shows like what the interests were or what um, how they thought things were.